The Good Burger is Singapore's newest food truck serving delicious plant-based Impossible Burgers that taste just like real beef, only a lot kinder and better for the planet. Very good. <laughs> I've been doing this for six months. <laughs> okay, yeah, all right. Hi, I'm Sophia. Hi, I'm Ken, and we're the founders of The Good Burger. We named our brand The Good Burger, not just because it's a great tasting burger, but because no animals were slaughtered in making of our burgers. So for now on our menu, we're offering three burgers. We have the classic, the black Thai, and one nine at Bangkok. So the classic is like an American cheeseburger, where you get your cheese, your pickles, your onions, and of course our special sauce. With the black Thai, if you like truffle, that's great, because it's got a truffle aioli with rocket leaves. It's really delicious, uh, very popular with kids. And the third burger is the one night in Bangkok. So the name kind of says it all. It's Thai flavours. It's not very spicy, but it's really flavourful. It's got flavours of lemongrass, galangal, and that is a real crowd pleaser. The classic and the one night in Bangkok is my favourite. I think it depends on my mood, because they're all very different. It's all very different taste profile, and they're all good. We're just regular folk, we eat meat, but we are trying to cut down on meat consumption. So this is our way of creating food options for people like us who know the impact of meat production to the environment. And actually all impossibles are not created equal, right? They're, they're not the same. So some people feel like if they've tried it once and then they think, oh, they've tried the product. But it's not the case because the impossible is just the raw ingredient, right? It's just what you use to make the patty. So if you have tried a bad one, you know, give ours a try. When we heard about Impossible Meats, which is the raw ingredient in our burgers, we had to try it. And we were amazed about how a plant-based burger can taste just like real meat. And this sparked an idea for us to start this food truck selling Impossible Burgers. The whole process took about four to six weeks to launch from idea to our first event. Everybody loves a food truck, right? Because it's fun. I think it helps us stand out in a crowded F&B market. Also, it allows us to get into a lot of high-profile events like Sentosa Grill Fest, Heineken F1 Party, and also the Conscious Festival to allow us to promote our brand and also our message. Our main mission is uh, really to use a good burger as a platform to drive change for a more sustainable future and a kinder world. The reception has been very positive. People are generally very receptive to the product because it tastes just like like real meat, so there's barely any compromise at all. Except there's less impact on the environment, there's no hormones that are in the meat, and it's a great product. I think in general, people are very open, right? They want to hear about the product, and it's a bit mind-boggling. What? Plant-based, but tastes like beef? Especially so after when they've eaten it. I think after they take the first bite, most people are blown away about how this is not meat. It's, yeah. it's, a, it's a vegetarian burger, it's a plant-based burger. So I think that's the biggest shock to the system for most people. And they'd be pleasantly surprised and a lot of them say, yeah, you know, I could turn vegetarian, you know, if there's more options like this. I think people who don't know about it get very excited when you actually kind of educate them. It's a new product. It's only available in America, Singapore, Hong Kong and Macau. So therefore, price would definitely be a bit higher. And, but we expect it's going to get better and it's just going to get more affordable as time goes by. Well, there's always a lot of education. As much as people know about Impossible, a lot of people don't either. Even until today, there's an education process. I hope that when people try the good burger, they can realise that a plant-based burger can taste as good as or even better than a regular beef burger. Without you know, the environmental impact, the, the hormones that are bad for your health, and also hurting animals to satisfy your craving. And that our burgers are awesome. Yes, that too. <laughs>